Good evening and welcome back once again. Today we are in the final group stage match of the Champions League. Winner will take top spot. We're both joint top at the moment. And we're going in with a strong lineup. We're going to continue playing Mudrick even though he is tired because he's on that flashing up. And no doubt that will disappear soon. So we want to make the most of it while we can. But let's jump in and see who can finish top. And obviously playing at Stamford Bridge today. Hopefully you have watched the past few videos, we've had some absolutely crackers. The last match was another 7-0, <laughs> the goals have been flying in lately. Um, brilliant performance, Circe started that one and got man of the match. It's good to see that. Castro back in today. But let's jump into this match. Again, this is, I mean, obviously finishing top does help because you're more likely, well, you will face the second place team, whichever... Um, Whichever team you're facing next, they would have finished second in their group. Doesn't necessarily mean you're going to get an easier draw. Um, all right. Well, that's not a great start. Was it Habits on the right here? Really nice ball through. A great finish there. Well. That's uh, not the start I wanted. Caught a bit flat-footed there, and that's not a good pass. Now, we did rest a couple of people in the last one for this match, specifically. The likes of Pedri. And obviously Castro. He did, did come off the bench and score, but uh, pretty much rested him for most of the match. Oh, decent ball in from Trippier. Didn't quite find the mark. Martinelli, and it's hit Castro, it's offside, but more importantly it stopped the ball, heading towards goal, a bit unfortunate there. Now remember this did finish 1-1 last time, we don't get many drop points, if you've been watching the channel we win the majority of our matches, here's GRB driving forward though, GRB, good block but... Martinelli was going to go for the shot, decided against it, and again we'll get a bit unfortunate there. Ooh, dangerous tackle, and they get away with it there, and somehow get the ball out. Our oh, referee, honestly, I'm getting so sick of them. The amount of fouls that just are not fouls given. And also the ones that are not given, that should be. Anyway, here's Martinelli. Now Castro. Mudrick. Castro. Just not strong enough there. I mean, Ch Chelsea's central defence is quite beasty. Um, nice play from Mudrick, though. That's a bit behind Martinelli. Take off just about keeping it in. No, no way through there. Again, good tackle from Mudrick. Remember, ex Chelsea boy. Great tackle from Neuer. That was <laughs> very typical Neuer. Um, regen obviously well it's a sloppy so far I don't like the way this is going um, and I thought we had the ball yeah Do you think Chelsea are a little bit of a bogey team? Just their style of play. Um, or style of defending. It's very much strength. Very extremely strong defenders. You know, beefy players. And we seem to struggle a little bit against that. But we're in here. How? I don't understand how he... 
hasn't got onto that. That's what I don't understand. The whole strength thing, but it somehow makes them quicker, even when they're not quick. I, it doesn't make any sense, but here's Martinelli. Now Pedri, oh, just wide. It's probably going to take something fairly spectacular or brilliant flowing move to get on the score sheet here. I mean, being one nil down is not great, but it's not the end of the world. Um, Jobby will get on this. It's a little bit behind him, though. Lemodric. Pedri. How did that pass not go through? It was a poor pass. No, that's not a great pass here. But Jobby gets back on it. He's got it. <laughs> and Castro gets the tap in. A little bit of luck. Not the best of goals. First of all, we give it away here. It's poor defending, and that actually drags the defender out as well. So, and it's nearly blocked there. Wasn't pretty, but we needed that before half time. Diaby, now Castro. Diaby again, Castro, Castro, great finish, and that's more like it, that's Malaga at its best, Castro holding up the ball, managed to get it back, Pedri lovely ball into Diaby, great strength and turn, and a beautiful finish. Back to goal, somehow got the strength to turn and shoot. And that's a quick turnaround. Two goals in a few minutes. Got to be careful, though. Chelsea obviously are looking pretty good. We've certainly been the more attacking team, but they look dangerous on the counter. Clearly got a high number of quality players. Madrid, Castro again. Ooh. Well, nearly got fortunate. Hit the post, which is a little bit unlucky, but comes back off. Let's have a look at this again. Beautiful strike, just inches from being perfect, but comes back and hits the goalkeeper and nearly goes in. I mean, that would have been an unfortunate goal for the keeper, but... Oh, nice flick on there. Just wide. And it'll be Chelsea now that are pleased to see half time. At this rate, it could be getting another. Oh, and Giobi was free, just couldn't quite get it. But Mudrick's here again. Now Martinelli. Castro. Diaby, Castro again, and it's a good save. Again, <laughs> Castro just coming into form. There's half time. Double from Castro after falling behind. So, all's not lost. That was a very quick start from Chelsea, just caught us a bit flat footed. But then we've been pretty dominant ever since. Got to be careful though. Pedri getting involved a little bit more. Now Zirkov. Nice ball in and Castro over. It's not... Well, I personally find heading very difficult in PES 2021. Always seems to head it over. Um, but good opportunity there. And now DRB with a little bit of space. Needs some support now. Gets tackled just as he's about to play the pass. I thought he got fouled there. Nice tackle from Bellingham. Now Pedri. Not the best ball to Madrid, but he gets it. Oof. 
Good strike. It was wide, but contact wise, it's beautiful. Of course, Mudrick playing a little bit more centrally today rather than out wide. Good tackle. Passes were getting pinged left, right, and centre there. Did well to stop it. Pedri. Now Diaby. Castro. Maybe taking a little bit too much time there. Here's Martinelli though. Pedri. And it's three. Again, we're patient. And it paid off. Thought I'd maybe overplayed it. But cycled it back around. Martinelli, nice little ball into Pedri. It's a really nice turn and finish. And we will look to make some substitutions before the kickoff resumes. Okay, so a few changes coming in. We're going to take off Mudrick for Fabio Vieira. Diaby's going to come off for Marie Ben. We're going to switch Pedri out wide to the right, which he hasn't played there yet, but he can do. And Xerxes going to come on to give Castro a rest. Even though he's on a hat-trick, he's done his job, and he needs to be fit and ready for the next game. Great performance from the guys going off there. Obviously, especially Castro. Mudrick's been brilliant as well, though, but he's absolutely flat out. Now, it's still only a two-goal lead, and... The quality that was seen from Chelsea when they decided to sort of turn it on. Um, you know, got to be very careful. And that's a poor pass. Yeah, just clear it. Nice play there. Now Zixi. Mortinelli. Just keep it for now. Take off in support. Now Martinelli. Oh, straight at the keeper. Try to fire it in. You never know what can happen. Could take the deflection. The keeper could fumble it. Nice header. But it's a good tackle. Take off Duel done it. Not for too long, but it was enough. And don't know why he ran off there. I've got to throw in. So he only takes a split second. You know, fired in the cross and he's in acres of space. It's well over in the end. Zirk off of a little bit of space here. Vieira back in the action. It's a nice ball to Martinelli. And back into Vieira. Good save. That'll be a corner. Zirk off. Oh, going for the first time volley. And he cracked it, but there's a defender in the way. Got a bullet of a left foot. Good play by Bellingham after he lost the ball initially. Now Mariba. Oh, he's offside. Yeah. Yeah, quite clearly there. Let's see the possession we've got. Almost exactly two thirds there. So we've been dominating for large periods, and then now and again Chelsea will show their, you know, a bit of a threat. And obviously, it worked the first time. Nice play there, Mariba. Now Vieira. Bit of space out wide. We've got time to. You know, play of the ball. Oh, Pedri. That was poor. Didn't mean to sprint that hard. Now 
well defended. Not the best ball to Pedri though. Can't afford to be sloppy. Can't afford to be sloppy. That was terrible defending. Well. Now we've got a match. There's only a few minutes left, but anything could happen here. Pedri. No tribute. Oh, nearly back to Pedri. And I could have done with that going out. Nice play, though. That was it. See. Oh, Pedri. He's looking a bit tired. And I don't know how we haven't got that. And this could cost us here. I had to take him out there. Didn't. Oop, hang on. Nope, I thought they were going to take it quickly. Still in danger though. 92 minutes. Good clearance there. And just thump forward. And there it is. 3-2. Got there in the end. <laughs> this is a bit too close for comfort. Castro getting man a match with his double. Diaby getting good ratings as well. Got the job done. Ended up winning 3-2. So we managed to squeak through in the end. But all that matters is that we won the match. We finished top of that group. We didn't lose any matches. And we're four points clear in the league. So the next match will be against Athletic Bilbao. Then we've got the Club World Cup. You can see there's a match there. If we win that match, we get through to the final. And then before you know it, it will be January. We can't wait for that to come because we are looking a little bit tired. Our squad's relatively small. We've got a lot of matches coming up. That's four competitions that we're involved in at the moment but join us next time hit that like button drop a comment down below and subscribe to the channel and i'll see you all next time cheers